Did Pope Francis just let the cat out of the bag, if you will, on the real intent of the Catholic Church towards the sin of sodomy? Um, here's a article right here. Um, Pope Francis admits using homophobic Italian slur, however you say that. Uh, this is the 28th of May, 2024, so two days ago. And he used this word in private that basically translates to faggotry or faggotness, talking about uh, sodomite seminarians and whatever else. Now, see, the Pope has been well known. Of course, he backpedals here. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend anybody, of course. But the Jesuit order, they're real true. They're appearing to be left right now, left-leaning, socialistic, communistic. But their real true agenda is to bring in an alt-right system. Um, and that's Bible prophecy. The Antichrist system is going to be an alt-right system. It's not going to be a liberal left system. Um, and that's when the killing's really going to get started. Think Nazi Germany. All right. Um, and I talked about this years ago in this video here on one, another mirror on another channel. Um, I don't control this channel, but a, a brother in the Lord controls this channel here. And this video was deleted um, by YouTube. They blocked it in certain countries and, and then they just completely got rid of it. But I'm gonna, just going to play something here because this is a you know, predictive programming on the Antichrist and total people control. And it shows basically what their future agenda is. I'm just going to play a little bit of this thing here. You can watch the whole video. I'll put links to it at the end. But listen to what he says here, this actor here. And I believe they're going to come out with a young pope. The Antichrist will probably be a young pope in the future, just as a possibility. But listen to what he says about the whole thing of the tolerance and all the other stuff and the ecumenical movement. Too. See, the, right now the Jesuits, Pope Francis is playing the, oh, we accept everybody and oh, we're okay with this and we're okay with all these things that the catechism says is sin and the Bible says is sin. Okay, it's all part of their smokescreen that they're doing. But this Pope that's coming in the future is going to be a radical nut. Listen to this. Brother Cardinals, from this day forward, we're not in no matter who's knocking on our door. We're in but only for God. From this day forward, everything that was wide open is going to be closed. Evangelization, we've already done it. Ecumenicalism, been there, done that. How about that? Ecumenical, ecumenicalism, been there, done that exactly what I just preached. I did not even know about this. This is blowing my mind. I'm watching this and going, <laughs> been there, done that. It's over. It's all fake. Listen to what he says. Tolerance doesn't live here anymore. It's been evicted. It vacated the house for the new tenant who has diametrically opposite tastes in decorating. We've been reaching out to others for years now. It's time to stop. And you can watch the rest of it. I mean, it's really creepy, that whole thing there, the Young Pope show. And it's interesting because this actor was actually at the, uh, whatever you call it, the Conference of Cardinals or whatever, when they picked Francis. He was actually there in person. Uh, sitting there watching the whole thing. I saw him interviewed and he talked about that. So, weird stuff, believe me. And I find it interesting. I mean, there's nothing that I'm doing wrong here. It's perfectly covered under the fair use clause of the U.S. copyright law thing. I'm just offering my opinions. You know, it's I'm changing the content. It's not me just playing the video and whatever. Um, I'm there giving religious commentary on it. And YouTube just, boom, boy, they took that video down. So it's still available on this channel. Hopefully after this video, it will still be there. Uh, they have no legal, you know, calls to take it down. But they don't want me exposing too much of the agenda. But that was seven years ago. All right, when I did this video here, and this brother mirrored it on his channel. So, uh, but just seeing this whole thing and, you know, the Pope in private 
and to the public, it's oh, we accept you know homosexuals and the whole thing. Privately, he's calling them derogatory names because they have future plans. If you're a sodomite and you're thinking that the Catholic Church is okay with you, uh, no, it's going to be um, one of the groups that's killed off in the future. I've tried to warn people about that, but just wanted to put together a quick video on this issue. Um, please be warned about the Roman Catholic system, especially the Jesuits. They are some bloodthirsty, uh, bloody killers. All right, you can watch my videos about them. I've been warning about them for years. One of the few preachers that does. All right, that's going to be it. Thank you for watching.